something much lighter uh, and hopefully delicious as well. I'm sure it will be. Joe Thompson joins us from Crisp Catering. Joe, it's always a pleasure. Thank you, sir. I see a whacking open an avocado there. We're making soup. Is that we right? We're going to make soup. All right. I know. Cold soup. <laughs> so once again, I just I told Joe I, one of my philosophies because I'll eat any, I'll try anything he makes. The food's always delicious, but if it's cold, it's not soup. Yeah, I can right. understand that. I think you'll, this hopefully will change your mind a little okay, bit. Okay. All right. What we're going to do is. We're going to start out with about a pound of avocados, which okay. is about three or four avocados. Okay. And of course, we're going to peel them. We're going to put them in a container. Okay. And add all our other ingredients. So we've all got right. some avocado. Avocado. We're going to add a little bit of cilantro. Okay. Um, and again, this is this is definitely a to taste type item. Okay. So if you like you cilantro, know, add more if you hate more. it. And exactly. I know people do. You know. Right. And you don't have to chop it too fine because we're going to actually use an emulsion blender at okay. the end. Okay. All right. Okay. So we're going to take the avocado. We're going to take cilantro. Then we get, this is where you get to play a little bit. You got some chilies. We've okay. got some serranos, we've got some jalapenos, we've got some sweet chilies. You can leave seeds in if you want. Sure, yeah, you're in the driver's seat. If yep. you like it hot, leave those seeds. If you, if you don't like, if you absolutely don't want hot, get the seeds out and scrape that lining off the inside right. and you take all the heat out of there. Right, any of the membrane. Okay, so, <laughs> Bethany just said, leave the seeds back there. So what we're doing all is right. we're just gonna get a rough chop on this as well. Okay. That's gonna wind up in our blender. Okay. Um, with the avocado, we're gonna take a couple juices of some lime, which okay. I've got right here. There we go, we're lime throw juice. Those in. Those in there. We're orange juice. <laughs> Are you okay. doing a mixed drink here? Yeah, Come sure on, tell like me it, the truth. Um, we're going to put a little bit of chicken broth. This is where, probably where it gets a little weird for you. Yes, it is. Um, we're going to add a little bit of chicken broth. This is basically to help us blend it. Okay. Um, we're going to wind up using that whole container of chicken broth when we're okay. done. We throw our avocados in here. All right. I, put I that am in. curious about this. Okay. I'm going to put my, <laughs> obviously this isn't to scale, but by the time we're done, we'll have one sure. to scale for you. Okay. Um, and then the very last ingredient, which is kind of my favorite, a little tequila. Yeah, and you got a high, looks like you got a high end tequila I here. You're not messing around. Okay. I do have a high end tequila. So, and again, this is whatever you want to do, mm -hmm. however you want to make it. Um, <laughs> the way this recipe started, margaritas and guacamole. Oh, so and you, you and combine them together. Yeah. And am I seeing this is salt? This down is salt, here? yeah. So, don't... what we're going to do is we're yeah. going to use an immersion blender on here, okay. make it nice and creamy. Okay. We're going to pour it through a sieve, drain it nice and smooth so it's okay. all very smooth. And then we're going to salt it to taste. Okay. And okay. Can, can we salt the rim as we well? We can salt the rim as well. <laughs> and it's all going to end up in? Uh, half of a I personal watermelon. I love it. All right. And we're going to talk about stick blenders, which is the, like one of my favorite tools in the whole kitchen. But that's coming up later on as we wrap up cooking. Uh, Crisp Catering, uh, we're also going to tell you about a cool event they have coming up in the summertime that you are going to love. But we'll get that next time. Okay, Joe? Sounds great. Thank you much. Bethany. Thank you. I love that little watermelon bowl. That's